Monster on the Rise is finally available on all platforms. New players will be joining the hunt for the first time, and many veteran hunters will start a new journey with their friends. My name is Nixing. In this guide, I will show you the weapon progression from Monster to Ice base game through Sunbreak. This will help you to avoid needless grind and make your hunt much more efficient. Now let's get started. Our first hunting home starts in Kamuro Tree. Upgrade to the second level as soon as you can. Once we have fought Izuchi, craft his hunting home and upgrade to level 2. Before we go into high rank, we can do the optional quest to get Grass Flute in the Bombagi Tree. This home provides Sonic Barrier as well as Health Regen. Its upgraded version can also be a really good one for endgame multiplayer. From here, we can go back to Izuchi Tree and craft Gale Home. In late high rank, we will be using Hidden Harmonic level 2 in Nagakuga Tree. In the endgame of Rise base game, we can use Bezogi's Hunting Horn as a raw damage weapon. Alternatively, you can also get Tigrex Horn. It has decent damage, but negative affinity. From here, we will be going to Sunbreak, Master Rank. For the first two ranks, we can use Kamura Warrior Flute. At Master Rank 3, we can forge Engineer's Hunting Horn. It also provides good melody as well as decent damage. For monsters that are not weak to fire, use Frost Moon Wailer from Luna Garen Tree. And once we fought Mazino, upgrade this hunting horn to Frost Moon Wailer Plus, and this weapon will help us to reach endgame. In the endgame, I recommend to you upgrade the Bombaji hunting horn to the highest level. This is a very useful hunting horn in multiplayer. If you're looking for another healing home, Horn of the Indomitable Plus from Anginus Tree is the go-to option. Be sure to add Handicraft to bring up the sharpness. For non-healing home, I recommend the final weapon in Pyrocna Tree. From here, I give you my recommendations for elemental weapons. For fire, use Horn of the Indomitable Plus. For water, use Sublime Bell Plus. For thunder, use Sky Tremor Rainbow. For ice, use Flicker Blazer Flute. Finally, on dragon, use the Gregorian in Shagaru Magala Tree. Now there you have it, my weapon progression guide for hunting home. If you want to learn how to play this weapon, or if you're looking for more endgame builds, please check out my other videos in the link below. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.